Hey guys, happy Valentine's Day and if you don't celebrate Valentine's Day then happy Sunday. So I'm doing a real love inspired set today with some red chrome and some sugared hearts. So let's dive straight in and I'll get on to the products that I used. So the chrome that I'm using looks best over a black base so you can either do this with gel polish and then a no wipe top coat for chroming but I'm actually using this accents black on which is a no wipe black top coat and then I'm using the most perfect red chrome from my store which is Nail Stamping Queen UK and it's such a lovely mirror metallic red it hasn't got any pink or orange undertones to it that you might see in some red chromes it is a true metallic red so if you're doing any sugar work I tend to find that a tack free gel works best so I'm using these tack free gel paints which are by Profiles Backstage which I do stock in my store and they are tack free so when you sugar them they don't leave any residue which is perfect. So I'm going to show you both the chrome in a matte and a shiny finish with the hearts on top so here I'm just applying one layer and it's really pigmented so that is really all you need and then I cure that for 60 seconds and then I just rub the chrome in and I always seal with a clear builder in a bottle and then go in with my desired top coat whether that's a shiny top coat or a matte top coat So with any matte top coat I always wipe with a bit of cleanser just in case there's a bit of residue on the top and obviously I'm painting on top with the gel paints. So all you need for this is basically a dotting tool and then I'm going to use my brush that's come into my store soon and it's just a very thin liner brush so just use whatever you fancy whatever's your favourite brush. So the two dots that were drawn with the dotting tool are going to form the basis of the top of your heart and then you just pull down with the liner brush. So depending on how big your dots are you can make them as big or as small as you like. That's going to dictate how big the heart's going to be. And then taking a really small dotting tool I'm just going to do some tiny little dots and then I'm going to sugar them with just some clear acrylic and then I'm going to pop it in the lamp for 60 seconds. And then you just dust off the excess acrylic once that comes out the lamp and because we've used a uh, tack free gel paint and because the chrome is all sealed that nail is ready to go. So I'm going to do exactly the same with the other nail but I'm going to leave the chrome shiny 
and I'm going to use the red gel paint and do exactly the same with the acrylic powder. If you ever feel alone, cause yeah, sometimes we'll feel alone. In a second, I'll be right there. Turn around, let it rain, turn around and let it rain on me. Don't you be afraid. Like a Friday night on the weekend I feel blessed and free I just don't want this moment to end But now you say you gotta go Baby, why you gotta go? Like the way where you reflect me I just don't want this I just don't want this moment to end Like a Friday night on the weekend I feel blessed and free I just don't want this moment to end But now you say you gotta go Baby, why you gotta go? So these are the finished nails. Let me know in the comments which you prefer, the matte or the shiny. I think I quite like the matte one because it gives it more of like a pearly finish and while i'm here actually i just wanted to say thank you so much for all your lovely comments on my video that i did a couple of days ago which was my first one back in a very long time and it was a little bit emotional actually reading those so thank you so much they are really appreciated so thank you so i shall see you in my next one bye you reflect me i just know with this I just don't want this moment to end